Welcome back to Sister Circle Live with Roots reaching as far back as Death Row Records. Young Ooh. CEO, Shug. He's come full circle and evolved into one of gospel and R&B music's most dynamic producers. He's, he's the mastermind behind gospel duo Mary Mary. This Grammy winner is keeping the momentum going with a new compilation album under the umbrella of his record label, My Block Inc. Please welcome the very talented Warren Campbell. Yay! Come step on the gum. Hey. Hello, hello. Hey, 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 hey. Hi. How you doing? Hey, hey, hey. Good to see you. Good to see you. Look at that smile, man. <laughs> it's just winning. Have a seat, sir. Let's go. Oh, step the purple, the purple pillow. pillow. That is your pillow. All now, right, the last time you were down to the circle, you were with your wife, Erica Campbell. You just had released All of My Life. The video yeah, is I'm awesome. I'm still with her. Yeah, I know. Not, uh, She's just not here. Right, of course. <laughs> no, no, no. Yes, absolutely. So, I mean, it got rave reviews. People love the record. Oh, wow, yeah. Are you going to do a solo album? What, me? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Not solo. Uh-huh. But I am going to do an album. Okay. We're working on it now. It comes out September 27th. Okay. It's Warren Campbell. We're doing a Warren Campbell Presents series. Right. Yes. Warren, this is Warren Campbell Presents My Block Inc., which right. is all my Which is what we're artists. talking about. But yeah. I was just trying to see if you were going to do your yeah, own we, thing. Yeah, we, I don't know about me. I'm going to do a song on that album. Okay. Okay. Where I sing by myself. Okay, good. Okay. Maybe I talk. I don't know. We'll see. Uh -huh. Is it already done, that part? That solo? Nope. That's Okay, good. So good. I just decided to do it while we were See? Look at right. that. <laughs> Look at God. Won't he do it? All right. I believe he will. Amen. Oh, Amen. Won't he will. Won't he will. <laughs> <laughs> right. So now, now you have a full-time ministry, yeah. And your church has grown just to just exponential just mm -hmm. limits. And your, yeah. your church, uh, California Worship Center, yes. Uh, it's it's like I said, it's growing. But tell me how uh, how do you think God has um, groomed you mm. musically to kind of segue into your ministry on the pulpit? Well, you know, first of all, coming from the music business and dealing with all those different personalities mm -hmm. and a lot of drama has more than prepared, prepared me for ministry because, you know, people think ministry means preaching. That's about 10% mm -hmm. of it. Yeah. Ministry means people yes. and dealing with people. And, and, and for some reason, when you're a pastor, they feel like you can fix their lives. So I have to quickly adjust them and say, yeah, I can't fix your life. Mm -hmm. I'm, yeah. I'm not qualified for that. I am your GPS. Mm. I just get you back to God and everyone. I see you going up. You know what GPS does? It course right. corrects. Right. Says rerouting. Yes. My job is to reroute, reroute you. Right, but they you, still have to drive. But hey. you got the, you driving right. the car. Yes. Mm -hmm. I can't drive for you. Right. I can't put gas in the car. Mm -hmm. Only lead that horse to water. Huh? Yes. Huh? Come on. If you're out of gas, I might give you a push. Right, right, right. Good <laughs> stuff. It. Good stuff. Well, your son, Wozy, is already in the pulpit. Mm. Oh, my God. Well, yeah. Let's take a look. If God didn't give us the spirit of fear, then it comes from the devil. Now here's what I want you to know. Whatever God doesn't give to us, we don't need. If God didn't give it to us, we don't need it. If God didn't give it to us, I can't use it. If God didn't give it to us, I don't want it. All right now, all right now. So, so as you oh. look at him, your only son, how does it feel oh, to man. see him in that same pulpit that you oh. preach from? The same pulpit I preach from, the same pulpit my father mm. preached from, the same pulpit oh, wow. my grandfather mm. preached from. He's a fourth generation wow. preacher. And it, it's all, those are his words. He asked to do it. And he's generally quiet around the house, but I was too. I, I grew up never saying anything. Mm -hmm. He's just nine years old. He's nine. Wow. Ooh. And this is all, this is something he wants to do, so. Mm -hmm. It wasn't something that you had to say, you know, you gonna, you know, you got no. this. Wow. Because nobody did that to me. Wow. You know, so he said one day, my father called the ministers up to pray for him. And he got up there and walked. I said, wait, where are you going? What? So after church, he said, I'm a minister too. I said, all right. I said, you know, you really, if you want to be a minister, you really got to love God. He said. And I do. Oh. <laughs> and serious. so from that point on, he's shown yeah. a lot of interest in yeah. that. Wow. Good stuff. Well, you all, you and Erica, you all, you've also passed on the gift of music mm -hmm. yeah. as well. So uh, yeah. any plans to release an album, even with the children? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, on this compilation album, my oldest daughter, Krista, she's yes. going to she's gonna do a song on the album. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. And uh, Wozy is now, he's a bass player. And and, and well, I don't know what Zaya's going to do. I don't know if she's going to box. <laughs> <laughs> rap, uh, I don't know. We trying to figure that out. Yeah. Trying to get her to stop uh, messing the house up. That's mm -hmm. what we trying to get her to do. Mm -hmm. But she can sing as well. 
Everybody yeah. just got a musical gift. They just, they just, they got it. Look at God. They got Look at it. that. They got it honest. Yes, yeah. they got it honest. Yes, they, they got, got it honest. What about writing? My oldest daughter, Krista, is an amazing writer. So a lot of the songs that you hear us doing now, she's writing on now. Like uh, Erica had a song called, uh, I forgot the name of that song. Uh, well done. Oh, God, okay. that's one of my favorite records by her. Yeah. Krista wrote on that song. Oh, that's, that's awesome. Good. That's yeah. awesome. That's awesome. So we're going to have more with super producer Warren Campbell when we come back to talk about his new compilation and more. Stay with us. Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We're back with super producer, pastor, and devoted family man, and a man with a great <laughs> smile, Mr. Warren Campbell. <laughs> yes! Hey, hey. <laughs> yes, well, speaking of music, mm -hmm. you have a new compilation album coming out yeah. under my block. Inc. Yes. Uh, September 20th. September 27th. It's all right, 27th. I just made that executive decision yesterday. We okay. It. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. I need some more time. Oh, you need, a little, you need one more week. <laughs> yeah. Okay, good, good. So with this being a compilation, tell us about the overall feel of the project. Well, when you have a bunch of artists on your label, uh, the first thing you're going to learn is that they all want their albums out tomorrow. Yes. Mm -hmm. So in order to kind of just, you know, uh, give them a little bit of what they want, I said, we're going to put a whole album together and get everybody out there at the same time. Right. And so we have everybody on the label. We, we just signed MC Light. Oh, nice. So Light's on the record. We just signed the, out of Houston, the Walls Group. Oh, yes. 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 So they're on there. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ah. We love them. We love them. <laughs> Uh, of course, Erica Campbell, she's, mm -hmm. and her single will be out for that album, which is a, uh, August 25th. Nice. Yes. A song called Praying and Believing, a video she's shooting, uh, directed by Megan Good. Nice, come nice. on yeah. now. And so, yeah, and so my sister Joy Starr, Tony Estes, Jason Champion, Jason McGee in the choir, mm -hmm. a new artist uh, named Lena Bird Miles from Oakland Ooh. is, you know, so we're, we're just kind of presenting my, 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 my musical family. Yeah. And they're all amazing. Yeah. Some amazing talent. You guys are going to love this. Good, good. That. That's gonna be How do you make sure you, you know, you're, as a producer, because you've worked with so many people, you've been in the game for so long, how do you make sure that each artist gets what they need but continue to stay relevant musically mm -hmm. and lyrically? Well, you got to dig into their personalities because if I give you my sound, it's just going to be me. Right. But if I sit there and talk to you long enough, I'm going to pull something out of you that's uniquely you and yours. So everybody has uh, their uh, their own feeling, their own style, their own. So I, I give them, that's like a tailor. Mm -hmm. I can't tailor a suit for you on somebody else's body. Right. So I, I give them what they need for them. And then, you know, it's going to be relevant because... If you're still breathing, <laughs> you're still relevant. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but, but you've always had your own kind of edge at the same time, though. So yeah, I, I was born in Watts. <laughs> 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 so, so, so what are some of the things that you kind of keep in mind when you were putting these records together? One is just sing-along ability. Sing-along yeah, ability. Man. Yeah. If, if we can't sing along with the song, I, I'm not going to put it out. Yes. Yeah. That's the thing. Like, I don't care what the style is. If I can't sing along with it, I don't care if it's hip hop, gospel, R&B, pop, whatever. Why are you doing it if we can't yeah. sing? Yeah. Like all of my life. I mean, that's like that's literally. Yeah. 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 Yeah, absolutely. You can do all this. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Anybody sing along with that? Right, 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 right. Is that what you do? No, oh, I know. It's fine. That's I be, I, I be the proverbial be said it on national TV. I be trying to do that, but it's fine. I have other gifts. You can hold, you can hold your own. It's all good. You can hold your own. It's all good. Speaking of holding your own, you all hold your own so well uh, in the reality TV space. Will we see more? You know what? Yes. Okay, good. Yeah. My kids just asked me. We, we did the last show uh, because the kids asked us to. So okay. now they're saying, can we do it again? Yeah. I'm like, all right, we'll figure out a way for us to make it happen. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's always easy, beautiful. Easy, but more, it's always great having you. Yeah. Thank you and for having me. Yeah, down to the circle. Yeah. Guys, make sure you check out Warren <laughs> Campbell and the entire My Block team mm -hmm. in their new compilation album on September 27th, yes. 27th on all digital streaming platforms. That's right. And the amazing conversation always continues at Sister Circle TV on all social media platforms. Please put your hands together for Mr. Warren Campbell. Woo! Love you.